Hey y'all, I'm back with another book review. So I finished Richard Rohr's The Nick and Down. And one thing that I thought was super brilliant about this, he said, um, instead of just focusing on the positives and seeing all the sunny, shy, sunny side of stuff, just accept that sometimes life is hard. Like, it's gonna be hard, that's the way it is. And like, though it's good to see good and bad in every situation, it's still like, okay like there is good and bad but don't just focus on the good you have to accept the bad and move on and embrace it and be like cool this is really hard for me to handle right now i don't know how to handle it but i'm gonna embrace it and focus on it and see that what it is and see what um see it for the challenge it is or whatever situation it is and just focusing on living in the now instead of escaping it or whatever was super impactful to me. Um, there was one other thought that I had while I was reading it that is escaping me now. Oh, was the idea of mystics. Um, I definitely thought it was... Um, focusing on the third eye and just having um, a way to view everything in reality, not just what's um, going on right now or looking at the sunny side or stuff like that. It was looking at the whole picture. And I loved the whole picture thing and how he was emphasizing on sometimes we get just so stuck in our things and we won't see the whole picture. And I was just like, oh, I definitely do that all the time. I definitely focus on one thing rather than focusing on the whole picture and um, really I just my focus is just loving other people and accepting them where they are and whatever situation is going on because that's what I need because I'm so flawed too so like I can't judge other people at all and so I'm just like if I love and accept other people's then more people will be willing to love and accept people where they are because Everybody's on their own journey. You can't judge somebody because they're in their journey here or you're in your journey here. Like, I just don't understand sometimes um, the judgments that are placed on people. Anyway, definitely a great book. Richard Rohr, definitely one of the greatest people. He's a little odd. Um, not your typical um, theologian, but I kind of love it. It kind of makes you turn everything on its head and really think about it. Anyway, I hope you all enjoyed this review and you all have a great day.